Got the seatbelt on, lights on. Brakes are a bit, a bit crusty. Haven't been used for a while. Alright, let's go and see what happens. I'm in second gear at the moment. There's no noise. <laughs> it's airy. Ooh, there's no power steering either. <laughs> Great! It's amazing! It's so quiet! So cool! This isn't focusing. <laughs> well, come on, jump on in. <laughs> it's amazing there's no engine. It's, it's ready to go. It's in gear, but there's no engine noise. It's amazing. <laughs> Oops. How cool is that? <laughs> I can't believe it. That is so bloody cool. <laughs> This must be the EV grin people talk about. <laughs> it's just worth every cent. How long has it been? Six, eight months? Eight months. Eight months. Eight months, and we've got the car running. <laughs> Here comes Veronica. We're gonna. This is awesome. It's so cool. Oh my god, I can't believe you have done it. I'm so proud. Oh, put it in gear. But quickly, because the pizza is burning. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Who needs food? Hopefully we'll not go by police police cars. Oh wow, that goes fast. Oh. <laughs> That's so cool. Oh my god. Well, I can just hear the vacuum pump. Mm, very quiet. It's about 60 amps to do uh, do 50 k's an hour, yeah. or 35 miles an hour. It's so quiet. Oh, wow. Well, we can't hear the vacuum pump. Oh, now I can. Oh, just. It sounds like a spaceship when it's standing. <laughs> <laughs> and it's so cool. Oh yeah! There we go, this is the end of the first test run. It is 9.08. That was the most amazing thing I have done all year. So, a few words for your adoring fans. Oh, wow, <laughs> convert your cars to electricity. <laughs> it is just the most amazing feeling. You have to do it. If you're not doing it already, if you're putting it off, do it today. Go and find a donor car. The feeling I've got here is just incredible. Oh, wow. This is just amazing. <laughs> Far out. Oh, can we do it again? <laughs> See what it's like from inside the car. You notice it's a lot noisier than it is uh, outside. It's, lou it's louder inside. Cars in reverse. Here's the hum of the controller. Put it into second gear. Still in 
in second gear. Let's do a U-turn here. Put my foot down. There we go, we're at 50 k's an hour. Goes pretty good. I like it. Well, the uh, project is by no means finished, but uh, we've made a huge leap test driving the car. It's going pretty good. Um, there's three teething areas, uh, teething problems that I want to sort out. Um, one of the batteries, uh, one of the brand new batteries, has a faulty cell. It's uh, it's testing very weak in one cell with a hygrometer, uh, which is very annoying. Um, but it's good to know it's nothing I've done. It's just uh, it's it's been that way since I've got it. I can see because the uh, the vent has been broken, it's been put on uh, incorrectly at some stage, uh, someone's broken it and one of the vents uh, has obviously allowed crap to get into the cell and that cell's pretty sick. Um, what else? The contactor uh, sometimes stays on after you've been driving with high amperage loads so uh, I want to see if I can figure out what's causing that. Um, generally it works okay but I want it to be perfect uh, and the high pedal lockout uh, that's still not working which means that um, when I put my foot on the accelerator and turn the key on nothing should happen but the car still spin, the motor still spins so uh, those are the three teething areas I've got to sort out then after that we uh, I'll get the back panels painted transport the car to Auckland get it certified and then I can actually drive on proper roads so watch this space Almost forgot. Keep an eye on uh, the website over the next few days because there's going to be a, another video coming soon. I'm not going to give you too many clues, but it involves me, a car transport trailer, the Tredia, a private road, and a TV camera crew.